The arrival of Tim Peake last week sparked the excitement for Salford University's Science Jam, which is part of the Manchester Science Festival. This year's event at Media City will be host to some of the most weird but fascinating features from across the whole festival. Organisers hope this will inspire future scientists, maybe even astronauts, but the main message they want to get across is just how fun science can be. From testing out your drone skills and trying to get the highest score, to having your brain hacked to optical illusions, there was something to interest everyone. It was the children who seemed to enjoy it most, however, and it wasn't hard for them to pick out their favourite parts. Shooting Spider-Man outside. I liked playing in the stand and controlling all of the books. And I, and I liked touching the millipede. Probably the uh, robot, because there's a robot downstairs. Science experts, lecturers and students alike were in full force to provide the best starting point for the next generation of geniuses. Well, we think it's crucial that, that young people get a sense of how much fun science can be, but also how many questions there are still to answer. So for everything that we're doing, the scientists there with all their cutting edge methods and all their technology still have big questions that we haven't solved. And so when you come along, you'll get a sense of how much we've done, but just how much still there is left to do. So we want young people to come along, understand that science is, is fun, that they can do it, that it's for them. It's not something that's just um, for other people, but this is open to everyone. And they can find their route into science. There are lots of different ways people get into science, and participating in a science festival is a really good start. Salford Science Jam has definitely been jam-packed full of science, tech, food, and even animals like this snake. I'm Matthew McGladdery, reporting for Keys News.